Once upon a time, there was a small village nestled in the heart of a dense forest. The villagers lived in peace and harmony, and the forest provided everything they needed for survival. However, there was one house that stood out from the rest. It was a grand old mansion that had stood abandoned for many years. The villagers whispered amongst themselves about the strange noises that came from the house at night, and many believed that it was haunted. One day, a young couple named Jack and Emily decided to move into the house. They had heard the rumors about the house, but they were not afraid. They were adventurers at heart and were always on the lookout for a new challenge. Jack and Emily were confident that they could make a home in the old mansion and prove to the villagers that there was nothing to be afraid of. The couple spent several months renovating the house. They worked tirelessly, day and night, to make it livable again. Slowly, the house began to look less like a haunted mansion and more like a cozy home. But as the months passed, strange things began to happen. At night, Jack and Emily would hear footsteps echoing through the halls, doors would creak open and shut on their own, and they could feel a cold breath on their necks. They tried to ignore these strange occurrences, but they only grew more frequent and intense. One night, Jack and Emily were awakened by a loud crash coming from the basement. They ran down to investigate and found that all of their tools and supplies had been scattered about the room. Jack was sure that he had locked the door to the basement, but now it was wide open. They searched the room for any signs of an intruder, but found nothing. The couple was now scared, but they refused to leave their home. They decided to seek help from the villagers. The villagers were reluctant to help, as they believed that the house was indeed haunted. But, seeing how determined Jack and Emily were to stay in the house, they agreed to help. The villagers brought in a wise old sage who was known for his ability to communicate with the dead. The sage spent the night in the house and in the morning, he told Jack and Emily that the house was indeed haunted by the spirit of a young woman who had died many years ago. The woman had been locked in the basement by her husband and left to die, and now her spirit was seeking revenge on all who entered the house. The sage advised Jack and Emily to leave the house and never return, but they refused to give up on their home. They decided to confront the spirit and lay her to rest. They searched the house and finally found a journal hidden in the basement that belonged to the young woman. The journal told the story of her tragic death, and Jack and Emily were filled with sorrow for her. They held a small ceremony in the basement, where they read from the journal and said goodbye to the spirit of the young woman. After the ceremony, the strange occurrences in the house ceased. Jack and Emily were finally able to live in peace, and the villagers no longer feared the house. Years passed and Jack and Emily grew old and gray. They passed on their home to their children, and the house became a symbol of hope and courage for the villagers. The story of the haunted house was passed down from generation to generation, and the villagers never forgot the bravery of Jack and Emily. And so, the house still stands, a testament to the courage of those who dared to confront their fears and lay the spirit of the young woman to rest. The villagers still whisper about the haunted house, but now they tell the story with a smile, knowing that the spirit of the young woman is finally at peace. However, every once in a while, on a quiet night, when the moon is full, a faint light can be seen flickering in the basement window of the house. And if one listens closely, they can hear the soft whispers of a young woman, telling her story to anyone who will listen. The villagers now view the house as a sacred place and every year they hold a memorial ceremony in honor of the young woman. They lay flowers at the basement window and light candles in her memory. The house is no longer seen as a place of fear, but as a place of remembrance and peace. As the years go by, the legend of the haunted house grows and spreads far beyond the village. People come from all over to visit the house and pay their respects to the young woman whose spirit still resides there. And though the house may be old and worn, its walls hold the memories of a tragic past, but also a testament to the power of love and the courage to overcome fear. The haunted house will always be remembered as a symbol of hope and bravery, a reminder that even in the darkest of places, there is always a way to find peace and lay the past to rest.